Yo guys, what's up? Welcome back. Today, I'm just going to be showing you a quick fix on Black Ops 3.exe. So basically, guys, um, I had this problem the other day where I opened up Black Ops like this uh, after it's, you know, finished updating. Uh, it's nothing to do with that. But you open it up, but it says Black Ops 3.exe has stopped working. Uh, now, this is like, pretty common, and it will get to the point if you keep running it, it will say the data is corrupted. It's not, and you don't have to re-download anything. The way you just solve this is if you've got AVG avast or any sort of like advanced antivirus software that could be the problem so what you do is you want to right click it uh find your antivirus software my my avg is just here you right click it and you click temporary temporarily disable avg protection i use 10 minutes um i don't know if any of the others use this but yeah 10 minutes you click it click ok you click yes so once you've clicked yes you will be able to open up black ops 3 uh if it doesn't do it the first time, just close it and redo it again. It, just because it hasn't like registered yet. But um, yeah, once Black Ops 3 is updated, you want to click no to that because it ain't going to make a difference. But what you do is you disable it and uh, Black Ops 3 should just start working. So you'll see the, like, the standard loading screen. Uh, so like this. Um, I'll go all the way through, uh, all the way through like to the actual start screen to prove it actually works. But yeah, this is like a, a really simple fix, guys. Uh, for your Black Ops 3, and I remember when I was having problems with this, I thought I had to re-download the whole game, and to be honest, like the game's 70 gigabytes with all the DLC, so you don't really want to do that. So, yeah, so here you go, as you can see guys, it's worked um, easy, so you just press start or whatever, and yeah, so, uh, that was a really simple fix for today, like, uh, also subscribe to the channel if you're new, um, like the video, if it helps you out, comment below if you've got any other problems that I can maybe help you out with, you wanted to learn how to connect your ps3 controller to your computer if you're playing on pc um simply just click my link in the description and check that tutorial out it's worth for loads of people otherwise subscribe to the channel for daily um daily mod uh daily modders uh daily daily content and i will see you guys in the next video goodbye